So, in case this is going to be the video that I'm going to upload for the daily challenge, um, I still have no clue about what's up with my weekly score as quasi demo score somewhat got submitted uh, with 10k of a score uh, which kind of resembled the previous version of the discers uh, and by then it was without uh, time scrap and the rest of the score details well i see the rest of the folks managed to get that one uh, somewhat like that uh, Burn even got one with the Stargate indicator. Okay, I did manage to delete some of the weekly challenge data, but I think somewhat uh, it doesn't really suffice, if at all, when it comes to deleting that certain uh, weekly challenge thing. So, uh, let's see if I can delete stuff a bit and then I'll come back to this uh, recording stuff. Yeah, no. Even deleting the all the challenge uh, folder doesn't really grab me anything. I have no idea what's up with that. Usually it can work, but at this rate, it doesn't seem to be the case I'm afraid of. So, alright then. I'm going to just let this weekly go and not gonna play it and even bothering on making it playable instead but yesterday we had a mission with slime and leaper I got everything into the ship with less than four minutes of a run overall um, some people a bit to take some damage from the slime room I think preferably the one with the damage turret of a room and yeah it was rather something. I had to utilize the root power because I thought like uh, it definitely boosts my speed and it certainly did. Got chip surfire for today. That's alright. So, uh, getting sensor as well. Ethan has 90 for drone HP in total. I, uh, I don't feel like using Ethan kind of drone. Uh, Salvage HP with 2 infestation type. Poor whole integrity and hazardous age, I see. Okay then. This is gonna get a little bit interesting because that means we can have so many infestation types in these areas but in a, such a lot distribution hmm. I will not start from A6 I don't think that will be the safest room for me to start from. A for A two is definitely the room I want to start with, or maybe A five. Oh, well, not A five then, because we have Leaper there. We got swarm, so leaper and swarm, no slime to worry about. We got stuff from room 5 Which is the room that Start with the swarm The ships get kind of survey All the fuels which is good Well Hello Oh 
Oh boy. Hmm. Okay, that leaper moves there. That swarm should move there too. Okay. Ah, some destroyed drones here. So... An aggressive swarms too. Okay, a little bit, a little, little bit of something there. I'm gonna have to visit this spot first. Uh huh. Maybe I treat that. Oh, jeez. All right. Okay. Ah, it's gonna be hard. Well, maybe not that hard to visit uh, room thirteen there. Thank you. 
That's all the fence worms. Okay, next up, visiting room 14 to get room 13 explored. Oh, that one, okay. Should be nothing at room 6 there. So, returning everything back to room 1. So, I wonder what that street turn has then. When it comes to... Loot stuff. Wow, pro. Wait, is this? Oh, that's a damage speed boost. That's gonna be a little bit tricky to bring about, which means I will have to swap one of my drones out. Okay, a little bit of a challenging coming then. Jump two, get your stealth with you. Alright, here's the thing. Swap Qbert. There you go. Swap one. Get the big boost out. Swap one here. Getting the uh, toe stuff on coming. Dock A4. Okay, so. I want Cory to be in here. I want Ethan never to move out again. Alright, so. We're doing this. And we're doing that. Make things back to normal. Nothing better than having a free of a exploration time kind of thing. This is also gonna be the part where I uh, kind of have to be speedy because it's gonna be radiation time coming soon. Maybe the 16 and A5. Wait, no. Oh well. So, A4. I haven't scanned A4. Hmm, I will still have to scan about uh, room 11 as well eventually. Okay, nothing there. Six, D12. 
Twenty four. Oh, yeah. I'm not gonna miss on looking at other things to see. I'm just gonna be out of there and not think about the radiation stuff. Overall, that was an interesting mission. With the possibility of you just kinda have to like swap it with the drones in order not to get your speed boost damage at the end of the mission. Congrats to Stefanovs on uh, beating my time and likely getting the speed boost intact. And yeah, some people finish that in uh, 30 minutes plus due to circumstances, which is rather understandable. Yeah, some people ain't too much on uh, running that mission clean, unfortunately. But there is still an interest in this mission. <laughs>